by it and smart. Alright, finally I got the correct angle. So, this is my first video. Five facts you need to know about me to subscribe and get to know me. Today's video is going to be about story time, about how I got into a fight on the cheese bus. So everybody knows what the cheese bus is. The cheese bus is basically the school bus. It picks you up from school and drops you off home. And a lot of drama goes on on the school bus. That's why I stopped taking the cheese bus. Because now I go to a school closer to my house. So I just walk home. It doesn't make sense getting into all that drama on the cheese bus. So, yeah. So here's the story time of how, how I got into a physical fight with somebody on my school bus. So, it all started when in the morning time I was getting on the bus, getting ready to go to school. And... Basically, these like five girls was in the front of the bus, like with their feet on the chair, blocking people from getting on the bus. So, so that's when I was like, "Excuse me, excuse me," and it was not moving. So, I took my hands and bow. I took, I took my physical hands and I kindly moved these girls' legs. So then one of them gets mad and was like, oh, you should not be touching me. Oh, hell no. Oh, and it was just annoying. So then on the school, when we got off the school, but she was just talking about me and everything. And I could care less because talking about me for what when I just kindly move your legs so I could get on the bus stupid so then I um I was talking about her with my friends because she was talking about me mind you I was in fifth grade I wasn't like smart and then I wasn't like you know I had any much like knowledge about like how to handle stuff I think so I, um, so, I told the principal, yeah, I was a tab to tell back then, I was a snitch, people used to call me snitch, so, yeah, oh, this light, alright, so, then, basically, um, we guys, well, let me not skip ahead, so, I told the principal what was happening, and she told him a whole different story, so, she told the principal that I called her a hoe and I was being disrespectful when I kind of just moved my leg. She was just telling a different story. So, and then when we got on the afternoon bus, like the bus that drops you off home, she, um, she was talking about me with her little friends in the front of the bus. I was with my friends in the back of the bus because we was on different ends. So then... It was like, yeah, it was like, she was the second to last stop, and I was the last stop. So, yeah, it happened, like, on the third to last stop, the fight. So then, I, um, she came up to my face with her big popcorn bag. And she was like, oh, you could say it to my face if you have something to say. And I was just like, well, you could do the same. So somebody on this side, on the chair, pushed her on top. This is when it started. Fight them. Fight stuff. Somebody pushed her over top of me. I thought 
I actually thought that she was like trying to fight me or something. So I did self defense. Like who wouldn't? Who would just be all calm without it? Not me. Especially not me. So so I um pushed her back and started swinging. I was not playing with her. Like and the funny thing is we both did not get suspended. Like we got into a physical fight. Everybody was like, oh, I won, I won. But it didn't really matter to me who won or who did it. As long as, like, as long as I got people to know that I don't play and, like, I will really beat somebody up. But, yeah, that's basically what happened. At the end of the day, girls are scared of me. So, at the end of the day, lesson of the story don't be talking about somebody you can't say to their face and then be mad when they start fighting you and start talking about you. Because that's basically, that's just being scared of them. In New York, we call it being pussy. So, yeah, guys. So, that was basically the end of the fight. So, we was, like, sent to the team's office and stuff. The bus driver had to turn around and go back to school. I was tight because my, my stop was, like, next and I was ready to go home. So then, yeah, I love it. Yeah, but guys, this was the end. This is the end of the video. Hope you guys enjoy. I will be posting more. This is my first video, so I don't judge if I really don't know how to like explain stuff. But yeah, like this, comment, share, and subscribe. And what should I call y'all? All right, I'm going to call y'all hashtag Raya Nation. All right? Because everybody be doing, everybody be doing, like, like, um, I'm going to just do a random name. Sarah's Mob, Kyla's Kingdom. I'm going to be different. So, hashtag Raya Nation. If you want the game, you cannot hang. So, yeah, guys, this is the end of the video. I know I said that, like, five times but yeah bye bye i'll be coming back with more bingo so